Hello, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for dropping by. Well, we've not a, got another great product from SV Boney to have a look at. And today it's their 90 degree dielectric diagonal. What makes this diagonal a cut above the rest is it's got dielectric coatings. Now on normal, on your stock diagonals, probably the one that you got with your telescope, um, it will be more than likely a aluminium or aluminium coating for our friends across the pond. Um, uh, an aluminium reflective coating that's put on there, just a single thin layer of aluminium. Now with this, with the dielectric coating, it's a completely different process and they put multiple layers of uh, reflective surface on. Now this results in a surface that's 99% reflectivity, which in a nutshell leads to brighter, clearer images. Now, if there's ever a weak link in a telescope, it usually is the diagonal. Now, you've heard about, you know, upgrading your eyepieces, uh, but it's no good having good quality uh, optics in your telescope, good quality eyepieces, and a poor quality diagonal. Because if there's ever a weak link in a telescope, it's usually this when it comes to uh, telescopes that accept diagonals. And uh, it's often overlooked by uh, beginners, you know, that they don't think they need to upgrade this. But believe me, upgrading your diagonal is just as effective as upgrading your eyepieces. In fact, if not a little bit more, because, uh, you know, like I say, um, when you upgrade your diagonal, it's a little bit like upgrading your telescope and your eyepieces, because this is one of the final things that light passes through. And if you're losing light through a, a, an inferior diagonal, then obviously you're gonna be losing light in your eyepiece. So upgrading your diagonal is just as advisable as upgrading your eyepieces. Apart from this having excellent optics, um, it's also, incredibly well built and the attention to detail SV Boney have not missed a trick. Um, now it's a fully metal construction. Um, it's got a fair bit of weight to it. I mean, it's not massively heavy and you don't want a great big heavy thing on the end of your telescope because that does start affecting balance. But as soon as you, you take it out of the box, again, you can tell it's quality. Um, it's uh, it's all blackened on the inside and one thing you will notice as soon as you take it out of the box and have a look in is just how much light's coming in there looking down there it's like looking at a shaving mirror <laughs> it's quite huge um, the other great thing that uh, SV Boney have included is a compression ring fitting here. Now, these are so much better than just a, having a uh, thumb screw, as where thumb screws, these little uh, thumb screws here, can sometimes scratch your eyepieces and, and just damage the, the overall look of them. But with these compression rings, uh, they actually grasp the eyepiece all the way around, uh, like a, an equal pressure, and it, uh, it's a lot more secure and it doesn't cause any uh, marking on your expensive eyepieces. should have mentioned actually this is an inch and a quarter so this will fit uh, inch and a quarter focuses and will accept inch and a quarter eyepieces. Um, another little feature that I'm glad they've included is a internal thread uh, on the on the end here. Now on diagonals this is so so useful because you can uh, directly put your filters uh, to, to this part of the uh, diagonal. Uh, you put filters and you can also put Barlow lens cells and this makes it uh, really uh, handy uh, and convenient as where instead of having to swap the filter out every time you change your eyepiece you can just simply change your eyepiece you know as will as you would normally and the uh, filter or the barlow stays in place a really useful feature um, on diagonals to have that thread At the minute you can get one of these amazing diagonals for around about 55 pounds i believe i'll flash the right price up on the screen there and uh, believe me folks, it's worth every penny. Um, I just couldn't believe the difference. If, you, if you're like me and, and like to go for the deep sky targets, you'll know that they can be quite a challenge. And it, it, it's literally like turning the, uh, turning the light switch up a little bit if it was on a dimmer switch. It's just like turning it up a little bit. You're just getting so much uh, more light grasp with one of these uh, dielectric mirrors. Um, and, uh, and just a noticeable difference compared to the aluminium. As always, folks, I will uh, leave links of where to grab one of these great little diagonals from in the description below. 
Well, that's about all I can really say about this fantastic little diagonal. Uh, I'd just like to thank SV Boney for sending me this and uh, having a look. And please remember, folks, that I'm not getting paid and no affiliate links uh, to SV Boney. I just give you my honest opinion of their products. And believe me, I've reviewed a fair few of SV Boney products and not once have I been disappointed. So I'm, uh, I'm sure you're not going to be disappointed with this um, quality little item here. Well, that's about all I can say about this fantastic little diagonal from uh, SV Boney. As always, folks, thank you so much for watching. If you've watched this far, don't forget, like, share, subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Bye for now.